friendly and hungry come as friends hope uh, your people will be good and praying for your nomination in sequence to my uh, previous videos on this uh, subject uh, i have done some more research and uh, digged out few more things that i am going to share with you people over here uh, in previous video i have shared that the mad fast type and am hungering am will be calculated based on uh, 50% of your hair score and 50% of your thermal degree and uh, many of the uh, aspirants were saying that this straight forward calculation might not happen uh, this year so uh, based on this uh, i have uh, made some more research in this and uh, let me share it with you people uh one thing i want to tell here that uh, what will be the merit calculation formula etc etc it's all speculation and all our predictions are you can say it's all our uh, impatience that we are doing all this research uh, so uh, there is nothing conclusive unless hcc breaks the chaos hcc actually has uh, done this uh, by the time i was selected for the scholarship at that time they were not certain merit was clearly out and uh, Uh, everybody was knowing uh, what his uh, merit will be and where the merit stands that was only for try but otherwise everybody was knowing where he his or her merit is stand uh okay uh what i have uh, observed this year specifically for the uh, scholarship uh, this scholarship that uh, the hat test that was conducted has a, a somewhat different uh kind of you can say scenarios this year uh, same is the case for the uh, people who have previously appeared in the usat and the hat test and people who have appeared this year correct me if i am wrong uh, there was number of categories for the usat test and at the same time the, there was different two uh, hat test one uh, test for the ms and the other for the phd these two were different tests conducted uh, in a different way although the previous hat categories was only Hat one till hat four, and for MS and PhD, everybody would have chosen his category, and the test was same. But I have observed this year that uh, hat for the MS and hat for the PhD were two different tests. And the uh, one thing I want to tell you people that the scholarships are awarded based on the discipline wise. It could not be like this that uh, all the people from the hat four group or the basic sciences group have been awarded scholarship, etc. so if we take the proposition that the scholarship will be awarded uh, merit will be calculated based on only the hat score in that case if hat four people have got the highest score so all the people going on the scholarship will be from the hat four this is never the case actually hcc has uh, its own uh, uh, seat allocation for the different discipline and i perceive that hcc was facing difficulty Uh, how to allocate scholarship on a discipline basis and how to roll out merit because if a person if the merit for the hat is 72 and there is no person from the social sciences or other department falling in that merit then uh, should they send all the people from engineering and technology and physics chemistry background no this could not be the case so keeping in view this consideration i perceive that hcc has conducted uh, this time test with all the discipline wise categories so what they can do at best they can simply pick the top notch depending upon the number of seats suppose they have uh, 20 seats for the discipline of management sciences and uh, they may select uh, they may pick top 100 people from the hat 2 uh, for the management sciences for the ms and similarly hat 2 for the management sciences for the phd in the ratio of 1 to 5 suppose if one person is to be selected uh, against a seat then they they can call five persons for the interview or initially shortlist five people so this might be one thing so if this is the case then it is going to fall uh, it is going to happen for the usat candidates as well there were number of usat categories discipline wise this year so uh, they can best do they can simply pick up the uh, top uh, 100 200 300 people in the ratio of 1 to 5 for the final selection and the nomination for the interview etc and amongst them they can make the interviews etc and later on on the later stage they will calculate uh, the aggregate that will include their hat score and their terminal degree and plus if they have given any preference to the interview or performance of the candidate 
and at the end final merit will be made out that <coughs> that merit may fall anywhere uh, we don't know but i perceive that uh, hc may may uh, do uh, merit calculation based on this because of the differences of the hair test from the previous years different categories different discipline even different category for the ms hat and the different category for the phd hat if anybody has any other research or uh, is having any different information uh, you may share at here and if you have any further questions you can uh, uh, subscribe my channel and uh, if you want to know the aggregate calculation formula there is another video on my channel uh, in which i have described how hc calculates aggregate uh, for the final merit So stay blessed uh, good luck Allah Hafiz